What am I gonna do for the rest of my life? It's freaking crawlers. Always shoot at feet with the uh, ray gun. Okay, I'm getting the fuck out of here now. That's one thing I always do is shoot at your, shoot at the zombie's feet. And I actually might keep this gun because if I can keep a distance, I should be okay. And uh, just, I don't know if I should even pack a punch it. I, someone told me that if you pack a punch the ray gun, it gets worse. Watch me have go down there, which I don't really believe. That would be really retarded. I'll get that. I want to get to these rounds quickly. Or at least I want to get to a higher round. Well, if I do want to get to a higher round, I may have shouldn't have gotten that nuke because, you know, the more points I can get, the better. So I kind of want to rack up points with my RPK here. If I could choose one perk, if I could choose one perk to have in zombies, it would have to be sleight of hand. I find sleight of hand to be so useful. You know, sleight of hand and juggernaut's, you know, pretty... They're up there, but I would have to pick sleight of hand over it. Because if I could, like, Notcher and Toten is a perfect, perfect, um... Uh, uh, what's it called? Oh, I just forgot the word. Example. What the fuck? How did I forget that? Uh, it, not sure in tone's a perfect example of how useful sleight of hand could be on that map. Because you, you're in that back corner. You're that you're by those grenades. That's like the strategy for that map. Well, not there is a, like another way you can run around, but uh, that is like the strategy for that map. So if you could have sleight of hand in that situation, oh my gosh. It would be 200 times easier. Well, you know, that's one perk I would love. What the hell is this guy doing? See, that's my. That's what I think is going to happen to me. I'm going to be shooting at the guys up here, and a guy from the side over there is going to come and kill me. Look at this. I'm just unloading on these guys. Okay, looking good. Whoops. See, as, as soon as I get hit once, I'm just like, fuck, I'm dead. Max ammo. Around. I don't know, should I get that? What do you mean? No. Should I get a crawler and maybe go to. Yeah, I'm gonna activate the landers. Let the carnage continue. This guy's a crawler. Kill one of them. And... No, I can't. No, I won't be able to upgrade this round. I think I'm going to upgrade the RPK first. Because I, I don't really have much need to upgrade the ray gun right now. There's no point. Uh, okay. There uh, we go. This guy. One thing I also wanted to mention is... Uh, Black Ops glitches. I'm gonna. I'm still gonna be posting a lot of zombie glitches because when I, before when I was uploading them, I didn't really think they would get that many views because it was you know Black Ops wasn't in its prime, and now that I see that they actually get a lot of views, I'm gonna. I guess a lot of glitches that I didn't include, like I left out, because because I was just kind of showing the simple glitches, the easy ones to do. And there are some that are kind of somewhat difficult, like, well, not really, there are there's some like out of the map lag switch glitches, I know a lot of those. So, I'm, I'm still going to post a lot more zombie glitches, but, and also Modern Warfare 3 time to time, but I'm, I mentioned that in my last commentary, I don't want to go through that again. But I just wanted to let you know guys that I'll still be posting zombie glitches, Jesus. I didn't see that guy whatsoever, and I didn't even think of that guy being there. So let's go with this last lander. Well, I'm not going to have a... Yeah, I'm just going to maybe... Actually, no, never mind. I was going to go to the box, but... Uh, I'm so tempted to buy Mule Kick. Okay. Last one. Should I get the teddy bear? Where is the teddy bear? I really don't like the song in this map. 
the only maps that I actually like like the song would have to be Jurize, Kino or Toten, um, Call of the Dead, and I like the one on Moon, but the Event Sevenfold one, not the one like the main Screamo Hardcore Screamo one, which is freaking I don't know what the fuck that is. I don't know how someone could like that type of music because it's like disturbing. It's like hardcore screamo, but uh, I like Shinonim is okay too, but my favorite has to be probably uh, Call of the Dead or Kino. Those are my favorite ones. And if you didn't know, my favorite zombie map is Shinonuma. <laughs> because I got to a really high round on the map. I got to around 303, I believe, on that map. But I think I've spent the most time playing that zombie map. Uh, when, back in the World of War days, I played a lot of World of War multiplayer, but I didn't... I played on the PS3, by the way. I was playing... I, I started off PS3, went to Xbox for a year, and came back to PlayStation. But I... Um, come on, get the fuck out of the window. I started playing World at War on the PlayStation, and I, I didn't play too much mods. Whoa! <laughs> that scared me big time. I didn't start playing, I didn't play too much multiplayer. I only got, like, for the first, my first Call of Duty was World at War, and I played all together, like, my first year of Call of Duty six days, which I think is quite a bit for someone who first started playing video games. Like, that was the first time I actually really started playing video games. I thought I was gonna go down there, I swear to god. Holy crap. I'm getting so fucking lucky. Reload the fucking ray gun. See, I can't... I don't want to get trapped right there. That's what I'm worried about. Jesus Christ, this ray gun is just tearing shit up. Fuck. That was close. Cause the, I'm gonna kind of demonstrate what I'm worried about here. I'm scared I'm gonna run around here, and there's gonna be zombies all along here, and I'll be, and I'll get stuck by a wall. Then I'll have to go back, and then I'll hit. Like if I had juggernaut, I could probably go back and around, or you know, or juggernaut PhD. But now that I don't have that, oh man. Oh fuck! Jesus, I don't like this. <laughs> I don't like no perks. It's oh god, thank you. Fuck. <laughs> that, it just scares the shit out of me because I have to be extra cautious. Everywhere they are exploding. This is not a good idea. Why did you make me do this? Like, I didn't think it'd be that hard. Like, funniest story. The first time I had ever. Oh shit. Thank god. Shit. The first time I ever played um, Durize on my... The first map pack I ever bought was Durize on my PlayStation 3. Uh, I didn't know what perks were. So, I I got that trophy, survived 20 rounds without buying any perks. And I was playing with four players, right? And I got to round 32, I think, on my very first try on Durize online. And I played like a uh, solo, uh, like twice. But my first try online, I got that trophy. To uh, I should have gone a crawl there, uh, but I that was the first attempt, and I was actually now that I look back at that, I was like, how the hell did I do that? I remember trying to get that achievement on the Xbox when I got the World of War version for Xbox. I, it took me a while to get it. I'm not gonna lie. Fuck. F M L. Fuck my life. This is this is a lot harder than I expected, I'm not gonna lie. I wasn't expecting this to be so intense. Fuck, come on. Okay, we're doing good. Okay. Oh, what? This ran over? 
Yeah, I think it is. I think I might go to the box. I think I guess I'll upgrade the ray gun, but I don't like. I don't think I should use the RPK. I want to get the thunder gun. Activate that. <laughs> 